Good day everyone, welcome to video tutorials presentation on 3D Studio Max, creating a house. Now let's take a look at the uh, 3D Studio Max program itself. Okay, so before we actually start creating a box, let's go uh, the house, we need to make a box first, so click on the box button. Let's go to the top view, click and drag out the box. This forms the length and breadth, then you drag up one more time to form the depth then click one last time and you get a 3D box here you can see this is a perspective view okay, let's right click on this perspective view to select the perspective view let's change the length segment to 3 width segment to 3 height segment to 3 ok if you want to see the segments themselves or edges you press F4 sorry select F4 ok now you can see the edges you don't want that to s you want it to disappear again just press F4 again okay now to mo I want to modify the select the object so I click on the modify tab here I want the length to be 200 the width to be 180 and the height to be 150 okay it looks a bit big here so you just select the perspective view use the mouse wheel to zoom out scroll it to zoom out you can click and hold click and drag using the mouse wheel to reposition the thing ok now let's take a look at the now we have this let's right click on the box and select convert to editable poly ok now let's go to here let's click on the plus button here I want to select vertex, vertices Okay, now let's take a look at the front view. Right click on it to select the front view. Then click and hold the middle mouse button or the the mouse wheel to sc scroll down or pan down. Okay, so I want to select the middle two buttons. So I click and drag to select a box selection box around the two center vertices. I want to move them so I click on the select and move button. I want to move them upwards so I click and drag upwards. Ok, then let go. Now I want to move out these two end buttons, uh, two end vertices, so I select them. Then I click on the select and scale. Then I, scale, I click and drag outwards to scale them outwards. Then I click on the move button because I want to move these vertices down until they are the same level as these vertices here. Then okay, so there you have it, a simple house. Thanks very much for listening. I'll see you. Next